Roger, the 2021 season has brought challenges for everybody, but for you specifically, we've seen you battle through injuries. We've seen you battle through personnel changes within your own offensive line. We've seen you battle just personally through life and being a human being. What has this season been like for you? It's definitely been like a, a mental strain. You know, when it comes to life in general, you got so many things you deal with outside of the game and then you, you have these struggles inside of the game. And, you know, luckily I've been talking to the right people and, and helping me through that. And I, and I love how consistent I've been and just, you know, my approach and just trying to make every day as best as I possibly can make it. Everyone talks about how hard you work. That grind really shows through. Where does that, I guess, mental toughness, that mentality come from and just the ability to keep going no matter what? Oh man, it was something that was instilled in me at a young age from my father. You know, uh, we, we used to always talk about, you know, uh, uh, hard work beats talent. And, you know, even when I was a young kid at nine years old, I used to do push-ups, sit-ups, and run around my neighborhood. Like that was my training as a little kid. And, and it kind of stuck, it kind of stuck. And, uh, you know, you get, get happy with the results at, at the end of the year. And uh, I've just been trying to stay consistent with that through my career. What makes all of this worth it for you? It's the grind. I fell in love with the grind when I was a little kid. You know, learning how to work hard was kind of like my whole MO my entire life. And, and then, you know, picking up on, on some talents here and there. But, you know, just the, the fact that there's always a journey, it's always the one goal. It gets so fun around this time of year. What does this game mean to you? It means everything to me. This is another opportunity to, to get closer to the goal of winning the championship. And uh, for me, it elevates my game completely. The focus goes up, the hard work goes up, the, the attentiveness in, in meetings, and then just overall gameplay. I've seen it just play better around this time of year. You know, this is, this is the type of games that bring out the best of you. The return of Derrick Henry is something that has Titans fans losing their mind, like actually going crazy. For this Titans offense, how much of a help is it to get a big, strong, physical back like Derrick Henry back in the lineup? I mean, honestly, I think it's like, what is the difference when you have your star player on the field? I mean, he, he takes a lot of attention in, in many different areas. He's going to make things easier for AJ, Julio, all of our wide receivers, tight ends. He's going to make those play fakes a little bit harder to see. It's just great to have him back on the field, have another leader on the field, have another star on the field, and, and see what exactly these defenses can do to really stop us. How much better is the offense now than it was in October when he left? Honestly, I think it, it kind of came down to just how consistent could we be and just being efficient in the run game and the pass game. And we've been starting to do that. We show signs of that. The thing that's great about this team is that there's always room for improvement. And we have never thought that we just arrived. Like we're continuing to work. The Titans faced the Cincinnati Bengals in 2020 in Cincinnati didn't get the win in that game. Do you go back that far and look at a game that you played against a team even though an entire season has passed? Honestly, I can't. I mean, I think that the entire look of the Bengals has completely changed. There's many different players in their front. They got great guys up front and on their defense. We've seen what uh, Jamar Chase has been able to do, and we see that they've been a high scoring offense. All of those are recipes for a playoff team, which they are. And for us, it's gonna be yet another challenge. I think that we just have to be excited that it's at our place and on our terms. It's a great day to have your best game. Make no mistake about it, y'all deserve this. All the work that y'all put in, y'all deserve this.